wife. I have been disappointed so many times by different ladies. I need a wife material who has a good character. One who will cuddle me when I'm feeling cold. A lady who will always shower me with love even when I err. One who can manage with me in time of lack and hardship. A wife material who can manage 500 naira to cook a pot of egusi soup with stock fish and meat. One who is not materialistic. Wherever she may be now, oh Lord, go and bring her for me. Even if she's 95 years old, but with all these qualities I desire in a woman, just bring her. I will manage. Thank you, Lord, for answering my prayers. For in Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Me and you will live as soon. Charity, me and you will live. Oh, me and you will live. Me and you will live as one. Cha cha, me and you will live as one. Charity, me and you will live as one. Oh, me and you will live. Me and you will live. Me and you will live as one. Wow. I'm happy I found love again after three failed relationships. Baby, I can do anything for you just to make you happy. I can trek from Lagos to London just to prove my love for you. Wow, that's so kind of you. I can deny myself food for three days just to make sure you are not hungry. I can stay awake all night to watch over you. I can do, undo, and redo. Can you kill a lion for me? Where is the lion? Let me start killing it. Okay, can you die for me? Pardon? What do you say? I said, can you die for me? No, nah. That one is a big task. If I die now, who will marry you? You want me to die so you can marry another person, right? No. Nothing like that. Jesus Christ has died on the cross of Calvary for everyone. So nobody is dying for anybody again. <laughs> I thought you said you can do anything for me, Mr. Caleb, the lover boy. Hello, I'm Dr. Victor calling from Vicky General Hospital. Am I on to Caleb or Mr. Caleb Tunes? Yes, live and direct. Please, we have an emergency here. Miss Charity is right here in our hospital. She needs an immediate medical attention and treatment. We called you because she mentioned your name as her fiancé. Please, sir, we need your attention right now in the hospital. Eh? My chacha? Please, which hospital? Vicky General Hospital. I'm coming there right now. Please come as fast as possible. Her case is critical. Welcome, Mr. Caleb. Your fiancé Charity is diagnosed with kidney failure. Her two kidneys are damaged and she needs a kidney transplant before the next 72 hours or else she will die. So, Mr. Caleb, can you donate one of your kidneys to her? Doctor, I'm not understanding. Please, can you repeat what you just said? I said your love at Charity has 72 hours to live on earth if nothing is done. She has kidney failure. The both kidneys are damaged. She needs one of your kidneys for survival. Let's carry out the operation immediately if you have agreed. What if I die in the process? Nothing will happen to you. We are professionals for this job. This is not the first time of doing this. We have done many and no single soul was lost. Please, I need to go and think about this. She's not my wife yet. What if she dumped me and marry another man? Sir, please, I'm doing my job. Do whatever you want to do before the next 72 hours. Have a nice day.
what kind of problem is this? I love charity, but I can't risk my life. How can I give her my kidney? A lady who I'm not sure if she will marry me. She may change her mind after giving her my kidney. I don't want to start managing life at this age. Charity, please, forgive me. I can't. Charity, is that you? No, it's my spirit. I have seen it all. You left me in the hospital to die. You did not bother to check back on me. Even if you cannot donate one of your kidneys, you should have at least shown little concern in finding a means of getting it elsewhere. Were well, you not the person that said you can do anything for me? For your information, my two kidneys are not damaged. It was a planned work. The doctor you met in the hospital is not even a doctor. He is my younger brother. I wanted to know how you will react to this kind of situation. You abandoned me at the point of death. I'm sorry. You failed the test. You are not the type of man I'm looking for. It is over between us. watching Mr. Keller Tunes. Please kindly subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click on the subscribe button to subscribe and also click on the bell beside it so we will be notified whenever we drop a new video. Please also share with your friends and drop a comment. Thank you very much and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.